Hey, uh, welcome back. So, what we're gonna do is just spend a little bit of time just doing what I'm gonna call some side questing videos. I know I've already published some Let that fall out. under this bracket, but this is leftover footage that I picked up while I was doing the main stories. So, I'm just gonna bundle them together. They're gonna be like mini little parts here and there. So, yeah, sit back and enjoy the side quest. And then once we wrap up all these, I'll finally dump into the DLCs. So anyway, sit back, enjoy, and this week's video is You're welcome. Death for you and me both. Right, so we are in the Commonwealth, just around the area of Bunker Hill. We round a lot of time. We're just level 20. I have just discovered Bunker Hill. And the only reason I keep saying that is so you can figure out where I am, this little play area. And a bit of a blink and you'll miss it thing is about to happen. Did you see it? Well, that's what today's video is, following on from Cabot. We're gonna look at the aliens. So let's just do this again. And yeah, just coming over the sky. There it is. A nice woofo. One more time. Super zoomed in, super slow. That's it. Right, that's it. Video over. Bye. Nah, I'm kidding. All right, so let's go and investigate a UFO. So, what we're gonna do very quickly is just when I was putting this video together, I saw this little moment. I'll go, I'll go leave it in. It's going back to the roots. I'm mellying. A death claw, damn right, and um, made mince meat out of it. Not even, not even a trap. Uh, it's broke a sweat. Words. Uh, so go ahead over to uh, Oberlin Station here. Now, I'll go leave this all in because I got a bit disorientated. But you can see kinda the direction I'm heading in, about south, southeast, kinda. That look like north, yeah, east. We're gonna go with east. You hit the river. Now south are on this river bank. That's the only way I can explain it. I got a bit lost, but as you can see, there's some broken trees and green blood. And yeah, a cave. So what I'm gonna do very quickly, just so you can see like the uh, assets that they use for this bit. Let's go and check on the UFO. So working backwards, we've been using the blood, we find the UFO and there's the trench it made as it crashed through. Um, I think I'm at level like 39-ish. So I nearly doubled my level time, so a lot of time has passed from it crashing to me actually be bothered to find it. Anyway, now I find it, go what you're meant to do, and follow the blood to take you to the cave. It's something may just have survived. So let's just check it out. Alright, so what we're going to do is be very sneaky. Oh, there he is. Oh, looking at him. Yeah, he's a bit too far away, I can't do that. So if I do, I'll go try and stealth it. So let's crouch down, get it. Thanks, McCready. You've just alerted him to everything. Cheers, mate. Well done. <sighs> but yeah, so there it is. Get around the corner and no health. Well, he did just survive a massive crash. One hit, one done. Oh, finished. Nice little cute little body. And so yeah, these are the Zetans. They've been in Fallout for years. There's been DLC in Fallout 3, Mothership Zeta, Zetan, Zeta, whatever. Now, the reason I've done this is when I did the Cabot video, it all kind of ties in. Now, there is another chunk, but that kind of ties into Nuka World. So I'm just going to leave this little part here. This is a little thing. You've got the alien blaster there and some rounds. Now, there's no other ammo in the game, as far as I'm aware. You can mod it at a weapons uh, bench, so it will take uh, laser fusion rounds or something. But it's a bit weaker. So do that at your own discretion. So I'm just going to loot here. So yeah. So it's tied a cabot with aliens. Obviously with uh, Lorenzo's helmet. Is it an alien artifact? Who knows? Uh, there we go. That is how you find the alien blaster. So yeah, level 20 is when the UFO shoots through the sky. You cure that. So there we go. Stay safe. Stay beautiful. Catch you next time. Bye.